It been 11 years. I held it in and I ain't shed a tear. I had a story I ain't never share. Thought it was normal cause they left us here. Just for the voices they will never hear. Walking out the courtroom, cameras everywhere. Yeah, and they say better join them, you can't beat them. Don't believe them cause oh, they're running against the oh. What's up YouTube? It's your boy K Lou. Back with another video, you feel me? Ooh, I look, I look kind of rough. Let me put a hat on real quick. All right, yeah, I need a haircut. But uh, so this is a non-traditional video for me at least because y'all yeah, know I normally play like game day vlogs. However, on our trip to Tennessee, I didn't vlog because I was so locked in and ready to play or whatever. I just forgot. I forgot. I ain't even gonna. I forgot. So today. We gonna watch the highlights together because I never really watched the highlights from the game. I know the results from the game, but I'm gonna show y'all the results. But what I need y'all to do is start what you're doing right now and subscribe. Subscribe to my channel because we're currently growing. And I appreciate y'all. I'm nothing without y'all. And the man above. But yeah, and drop a like on this video. Don't go any further before you like this video. But that's all I said tonight. Let's get started. We started with the ball first. Couldn't really get that going. Because them boys was strong. Them boys was huge. So, they got the ball. We ain't do that. They tempo is crazy. Like, tempo, tempo, tempo. They go real fast. They run like three plays in under a minute. So, I got started in the game or whatever. It got me out of the game because I was in the dime package. So, they took us out. You see, they ran the ball down here and scored or whatever. It was really like... Like the tempo, it was hard to get lined up because they was going so fast. Okay, so we down 7-0, we get the ball back, whatever. Big time players made big time plays. Shout out to Jay Wayne, y'all see that catch right there. The Tennessee DBs won it. They was not it. I see they corners. Well, miscommunication right here led to broken play. Took a TFL. And um, Dez was not quarterback because uh, Jake was hurt. Jake been hurt. So Tennessee got the ball back. It was a big run. Remember? But you got Keith with a, a big time tackle. Because that's what Keith do. Big time tackle right there. Trying to get lined up. And they, they all sit and ready to go. So they broke a run or whatever. We got to make tackles. We got to make these open field tackles. You know, he got like 10 yards out the contest. Right so they went up 14. You know, whatever. They had some athletes though. All right, so we got the ball back. Whatever. No, another big time play. Jalen Tolbert, shout out to that boy. You feel me? That boy Golden, best receiver in, some, uh, in South Alabama history. So we got the big play or whatever, but we just couldn't punch it in. Like, we'll get to like the red zone or whatever, and we couldn't, couldn't convert, you feel me? See here, look. Fall down. Give him the sack. You know, we've been there in the O-line and stuff all year. So they play a factor. Team is pressing us a lot and stuff like that. I know him right there. I know Trey. Okay, let's see. Okay, so we had him on third and 11, and we just missed some tackles. Missed tackles is like a big part of this game. The game could have been way different if we made tackles. And then they just, they were scheming us up. You see. Getting out of hand because they tempo, they tempo is fast. And right, so we got the ball back down 21 0. We just we can't really can't do that. Receiver calling late. Stuck. Got a punt off, whatever. Pressure, but Brooks got it away. Hey, this guy from Mobile, he he pretty nice. From the 30 starts his return to the 40 to the 50. He, he almost got though. He almost got though, man. Ain't he gone? Can he count? See, I'm in there. They got me on the screen to go. I had to react to the screen. They got me on the screen to go. They hit the scene right behind. Again. Three minutes left in the half. We ran a fake and you know your boy Keith slid. Look, look at him. Look at him. That boy got like two carries for like 64 yards in there. That was a nice little run right there, Keith. Shout out to that boy Legal. Now we gotta try to punch it in, get some points before the half, whatever. Whatever. 
Cause they some babies. I told you. Bo had a long day. Bo was getting bummed on all day. No disrespect, but he just had a bad game. Alright, so we in the red zone, third down, whatever. We just we just couldn't convert. Oh, we scored here. We scored here. Shout out to Lincoln. We scored here. But we got to the red zone a lot this game, man. Didn't punch it in, you feel me? With his fourth receiving touchdown of the year. Mm, that's like a little, I guess a little wide slide play or whatever. Oh, he can go, huh? He, he just ran like a little drag. A little mess route, whatever. <sighs> okay, now this play right here hurt us. This hurt us right here. The boy Valus, Zealus, everything, man. Look, get this. He, he slid. They say this guy run like a full three or something like that. Yeah, of course, I found out later in the game what he ran. But that was big for halftime. Went up 35 seconds. It just, and when they going our way at this point, for real, for real. It just, it just won that night scene, like. Okay. He went to, like, a, a better steal and took back all the running. That's crazy. Yeah, that was, that was a nice kick. He's nice. He's a nice, he nice player. Can he count? Now they replaying it over and over again. Yeah. They could have showed you this one. Look, the sideline on height. Ain't gonna lie, that atmosphere was nice, though. Alright, so third and seven. We couldn't really get that going. But the atmosphere was nice. The stadium was real nice. Like, it felt like we was in a movie out there warming up because, you know, South Alabama is a smaller school, you feel me? So we don't get to play in stadiums this big. But this stadium holds 100,000. So it was a blessing to be able to play on that big of a stage. You feel me? So, yeah, we got we got to stop for halftime, whatever. Came out of halftime, kicked the onside kick, you know, because we needed, we needed a momentum swing, whatever. We got it, of course. You feel me? AJ recovered it. You know, we, we had hope, we had some hope, whatever. But we got to throw some points. We, you see, we won and on the third down. You see, Kimmy ain't had no time. You know, they were pressuring, so he did what he could do. In the third quarter, they come out take a shot. Fifty fifty ball, we lost fifty fifty ball. It happens, it happens. But was a decent receiver too. Giving him a chance, an excellent job. Been pretty good. And like we, this the second effort. Like we was getting the initial stop, but like this the second effort was driving back. We just wasn't finishing on, in a dumb position as coach was finishing in dumb It's 42-7 at this point, whatever. I miss you, Cap. He broke me down. I can't even count. He broke me down. They ain't gonna replay that, though, so that's a good thing. And then right after that, we got a sack. You feel me? Some good stuff happening. You feel me? But this next play. Ah, I can't. It's, it's, next play is. He got me. I was in good position, but I ended up pushing him off me, giving him separation or whatever. It was third and 13. I was in great position, and then just, whew, he slipped past me. And it was on to the races. The man took off on me. But it happens as a DB. You just gotta have a short term memory. You're gonna give up kids if you do. So this, this possession, it was my fault. I gave him a big catch. It could have been prevented. I didn't help contribute to that um to that defensive drive. A good run, Ring. Good run, Ring. That boy Kareem was running the ball there. But at this point, the game got out of hand, so there really wasn't too much we can do. Third and five here. He may really have time. They were hitting us with some mean stunts, whatever. Seven yard line. I was talking, 
just went out day. Sorry for the interruption. It just wasn't out day. Couldn't really do this. <sighs> Dude, this game hurt. It hurt to sit up and do this, but I feel like I owe y'all kind of like a, a video explaining like what happened. So I just say wrong. Hey, Tober made a great play right here. Four and three, just get your playmakers the ball. You feel me? He's showing up why he won the best in the nation. It was a great play right there. Shout out to Tober. Immobile native. You feel me? Yeah, that was a great play though. Just get it to him. Good stuff happens. Oh. Oh. He got out on him. It was 56 14, fourth quarter. We need to waste some time at this point because it's not a hand. We got the ball third and 12. So we got a safety. Yeah, made it 58. Just like I said, once again, it, it just wasn't our game. You see, we lost uh, 6 to 14. But. <laughs> Big thing is we get the chance to rebound this week against Coastal Carolina. Big game. We got five wins. We need our six win to try to go to a bowl game. I would like to go to a bowl game because I haven't been to one in my whole in all of my years here. Yeah, so that would be nice. Tennessee is out with a bowl game or whatever. But yeah, Tennessee was real nice, man. I finished with like five tackles. They didn't include them in the highlights. I don't know why. Let me show y'all. Let me show y'all some of But um, it was a great experience. Whatever. You gotta thank God for allowing us to be able to play the game and just go experience that environment. Experience that environment. And yeah, Tennessee, they they gonna win some football games in the future. But they gonna be a pretty good team. Mainly because of their tempo. Their tempo is hard to adjust. To. We thought we practiced like practiced the tempo well, whatever. But you get in the game, it's like completely different. You can't even prepare for that for real. So. I mean, stuff happens, you feel me? But, but overall, just gotta keep chopping wood, whatever. Keep working hard. Luckily, our season don't end with this loss or whatever, because this would be a terrible loss on our resume. I mean, still on our resume, but at the end of the season, we got a long off season thinking about it. If this was our last game, come on. Would we really want to go out like this? But now, like I said, we get a chance to redeem ourselves. And yeah. But with all that being said and done, I appreciate y'all for tuning in to this video, just to check to see how the game went against Tennessee. I mean, it didn't go too good for us, you feel me? But you gotta keep getting better, keep grinding, keep putting in the work, you feel me? I had a decent game, other than one catch I gave up. It happens, DB lifestyle, but I bounce back, I always do. There's one thing about me, I always bounce back, but. Don't forget to subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. Like this video, leave a comment if you enjoyed it. I appreciate y'all. The marathon continues. It's your boy, Kalu Jr. Checking out.